Key date mindsets coming right up. First of all, assume she is interested. You've talked to her in a hopefully sober conversation if we're talking about, you know, cold approach during the day, non-bar, non-club environment for five to ten minutes. She's flirt. You're flirting with her. You've got to know each other. You've both seen each other in cold lights of day. You've both seen how you act. She's given you the number. Hopefully, she's really wanting to give you the number. If she's coming out on a date, she is interested. It's the biggest thing uh, to just to begin with. Just just remembering that as part of the process. It's so easy to think. I used to think go on dates thinking I've got to do all this stuff. It's not. You've got to escalate, build a bit of comfort, and then take her home. Um, she is coming out because she's interested. Women do not put themselves one-on-one -on -one with a guy uh, in a situation with alcohol where she knows that you, you know, she knows that you like her um, if she's not keen. She doesn't do it. It might happen like one in 50 times if the girl, if you, you're, you're, you're coming across a really nice guy and really kind of providery and you're in somewhere like Russia or Ukraine, well, you won't be at the moment, but if you were, um, typically former Soviet Union they, they can be sharkish there they're looking for, for free males or free English lessons or if you met her on Tinder you can't be sure but usually speak generally speaking direct cold approach she is fucking interested right so just that is my key mindset number one going on the date realising she's keen she's really really keen for it to go down yeah the second mindset is as James is saying especially if you met the girl during the day you met her at a setting where you were acting confidently. You were the guy who actually took action and went up and talked to this girl. A lot of guys make this mistake where when they come into the date, they just shy away from doing that within the date because they're like, oh, I put so much effort to get to this date. Now that I have the date, I don't want to mess it up. I don't know how this is going to go. But when a girl comes onto the date and you met her during the day and you did something that 95% of guys would never do, she expects you to keep doing that. She expects you to lead. She expects you to be bold. She expects you to make a move, try to kiss her, try to take her back. And if you're not doing that, you're actually being incongruent. So it's going to affect you in a negative way. So the second mindset is if you're going on the date, whether you're looking for something more casual or even if you're looking for a girlfriend, it's better that you move things forward, that you lead, you try to get her back. Because when that's the precedent you set from the get-go, she will understand, okay, this is a guy who goes for what he wants and for a woman that's very attractive. Yeah, she's, she, you know, women don't really understand what day game is. So she just sees what, she sees the, what she's presented with, right? She sees a guy who's looked at her, who's gone up to her, maybe in a coffee shop or on the street, given her a compliment, made her feel good because you understand what direct day game is, you understand how to flirt and banter, you understand that's going to make her feel attraction, right? You're demonstrating confidence, which is a massive attraction trigger as well. You've had a fun, flirty conversation with her. She's put you in that far sex guy box, right? Women put men into two categories, either the provider dude or the fucking player dude who gets laid like a rock star. And you decide which box you put yourself in with direct day game, we put ourselves into that far sex guy box. So if you go on the date and you don't escalate and you don't go for it, she's confused. You're not being congruent because in girl world, she's expecting to go out and probably that you're going to try it on. She may or may not have sex with you, but she's expecting you to go for it. So that's the other thing. I mean, that's, that's a big sick thing I had with my own development with this. I got really good at the party trick of 10 minute day game coming across like a bit of a player. But then I wasn't backing up on dates because I didn't know really how to act. And I didn't fully believe I was that far sex guy. But then through the process of trial and error, I got better and better and better. And then I actually just became that guy. So just going with the mindset of just going for it. You're going to try and take her home. You're going to try and kiss her quick. She's come out because she wants it to go down. Women enjoy sex. You know, arguably more than men. We can't have multiple orgasms, or at least I can't. It's the last time I checked. Um, even with that game, this show. <laughs> so, you know, you just go for it, have some fun, and but just go for it. And if you're struggling with the date stuff, get in touch with us because a lot of what we do is actually going on dates with guys and listening in and giving them feedback. That is your two key date mindsets which should 10x your results for dates. Let us know in the comments how it went and get in touch with either of us if you feel like a consultation to sort this area out. Peace.